Hey, Zach here from digitalconstructive.com and in this video, we're gonna be talking about how to pass your C-12 license exam. Now the C-12 Earthwork and Paving Contractor License Exam is gonna be made up of four sections, planning and estimation, earthwork and grading control, paving, and safety. Now if you're unfamiliar with the C-12 license, you should check out our previous video where we go deep into detail on this license. Today, we're just gonna focus on the examination. Now, as is the case with the California Contractor License C Specialty Classification, you'll need to pass your CSLB Law and Business Exam, and that'll include business organization, business finances, employment requirements, bonds, insurance, and liens, contract requirements and execution, licensing requirements, public works, and there'll be a section on safety. So essentially, you've got to pass two tests, 115 questions covering law and business and 115 questions covering earthwork and paving. It's gonna be multiple choice, closed book. You'll get three hours to complete each section. It's gonna be a computerized exam that you'll do at a CSLB testing facility. So if you're somebody that's applying from out of state, just know you will need to come to California to take the exam. Now we've got a free guide that breaks the entire licensing process down. You'll wanna check that out in the top right-hand corner. Now, the earthwork and paving specialty portion of your test is gonna be extremely important. You're gonna be tested on earthwork and grade control, soils and geology, excavation and trenching, estimation, project layout, analyzing plans and specifications, roadways, driveways, and parking lots, traffic control, environmental impact, demolition and pavement repair, and employee safety. Now there's a lot that's gonna be on the test in addition to this, but these are kind of the core areas that you're gonna need to be prepared to answer questions on. Now, the mathematics that you're gonna wanna have uh, tight going into this exam are gonna obviously include your applied math. So, you know, you need to know addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division, obviously, uh, calculating square footage, understanding the different units of measurement, inches, feet, pounds, and tons. Um, geology will, you know, obviously, be a part of this too and the mathematics of geology but you know obviously as with all contractor licenses job costing and estimation are going to be included also so when you're preparing for this test you're really going to want to make sure that you're tight on your california law and business you want to make sure that you understand your trade specific fundamentals and that you've seen the possible c12 related questions that could appear on the test You'll want to make sure that you're familiar with the California Health and Safety Codes because California takes environmental safety, environmental impact, uh, water conservation, job site safety, employees' rights. These are all areas that are very, very important in California, so it's going to be a significant portion of your exam. And then obviously your fundamental math skills, common equations, formulas. You want to have test taking experience, timed online exams with flashcards and answers with explanations that give you a little bit of context as to why the questions are correct and why they're incorrect. You'll want to understand this uh, through walkthroughs of the exam with licensed contractors and lawyers that are helping you decipher the language, break down the test give you real key insight, and not only help you pass the exam, but give you insight in how to run an effective and profitable contracting business in California specifically. All of this is gonna be included in our C12 license program. Uh, definitely, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. Like and subscribe to our channel. I hope you found this video helpful. Uh, thanks again for watching. This is Zach from digitalconstructive.com.